All right, the map is America, and we're this dot right here. Hello, that's us, Australia. Australia and South America, I see over there. Okay, we got, uh, oh, those guys just got both. Do you believe that bad luck those guys just had? Both of these guys had AFK random spawns right on top of them. That's so unlucky for them. That's so unlucky for them. It's really gonna hurt their early game. That is pain. I feel that pain both of them. What are the odds of that? Just like right on top of them, both of them. Alright, get 3k and then just do lots of those sends. This is a new strategy I'm trying. Get get above 3k and just do like lots of little sends. Here we go. Keep our trucing nice and high here. Keep our truces up. Who's looking weak? You guys. Looking for the weak ones. Vulnerable. Oh, who is targetable here? You guys are all looking like nice targets. I don't want to pin this guy in behind me. You can work your way down southwards, I think, would be good. Give you places to attack other than me. I right, keep carving through these. Hmm. Focus on these ones. We wait. Can I, do I have borders on you? I do. I'm chilling here. So this weak one. While you're... Oh, troops came back, huh? There we go. Keep getting this. Keep getting this. We'll boat across there. More of that for us. Um, I don't know. I want this guy to... I, I'm not going to... I'm going to let him... Do I let him have all that land? I think I do, right? I want him to have somewhere to attack other than us. If I blocked him off there, then we just don't give... Or get some of that. I want him to have somebody to attack other than us. If I took that bot and made so he was blocked, locked in behind us, he would only attack us, and that's no good. I did hurt my land growth earlier there. We're only in sixth place. Not great. But, um, I need this guy to have somebody attack other than us right now. I think we're big enough that we can... <sighs> we're touching boards with this guy. We gotta save up. I was gonna say, I think we're big enough to push this guy before he builds up too much, but unfortunately, we, uh, this guy's got 400k down there, so we gotta slow roll it. I don't like being this close to the leaderboard. Uh, we're 6,000 pixels behind them in size. Not great, but we can make up for it with superior strategies. Let's see what we can do here. Gotta keep saving up here. Looking for nice little targets. A little bit here. Free land is free land. Uh, we did not reap much of the rewards of that, though, unfortunately. Such is life. Empire Waifu's having a hard time over there. DVD's attacking Josette. We'll let them do that because that's... Yeah, actually, them, these guys... Weakening Joe's, that's actually good for us. Well, that does let me know they're the kind of guys. The fact that Wife is not afraid to attack someone else bigger than them is okay, okay. We keep saving up here, and I think we attack Wife from back. Wife is not afraid to attack somebody bigger than them, which could be a problem for us in the future. They seem like good players. The way the team up leaderboard is good now, but it's going to bite us in the back later, I'm pretty sure. Let's we'll keep saving up here, I think. Wait for a moment. Wait for, uh,. Get the Empire Waifu. Like, you're especially scary. The fact that you're willing to attack somebody that much bigger than you is really scary. I get more land for taking out DVD. Oh, this guy's attacking us the back, huh? Well, we'll let... Uh, deal with you later. Teach you a lesson. Gotta make sure this guy, uh... The ones that are... F uh, the problem is this guy... I, I want to, uh... Attack in on this, but this guy's gonna get us from behind. Away from the weak... There, it's a full send. Nice, 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 nice. Good value for us there. Oh, Anteater's getting hit. That little island right there. This elite Blitzkrieg guy in the back wanted to attack us, except this guy below is a problem. Nice. Oh, double, double full send. Since this guy's shown he wants to attack us anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead and block him behind us. He's already shown he's rather would rather attack us than, um... Nice, another full send. He's already shown he would rather attack us than the guy below him, even though he's bigger than the guy below him. So clearly we're gonna lock him back there. We're in second place now. Clearly, we're going to deal with him. Questions: we deal with him, deal with him now? He's at max cap. Let's say we deal with him once we uh, hit 0.5%. Because he's shown he's not afraid to attack somebody bigger than them. Even when there's a smaller target, which would be better for him to go for. A little truce with you. Start working on you. Slowly work on you behind us. This guy's almost as big as us here. It's all about uh, politics at this point. There, he left. Nice. That's actually great for us. Alright. We go for Armenia. We don't get that much of it. I feel like Ace Nords is the next logical choice. Oh, these guys are busy going downwards, huh? If they're going to focus on going downwards, I need to get on that too, actually. 
I can't have these guys both thread downwards and me not get any of it. That would be bad for me. He full sent on them, which is huge for us. I don't get as much of this as I would like. I do get some. I can actually boat my way down to here now, right? Yeah, that'll be good for us. Down here? Nice. Hmm. I'm going to attack you before you get too big, though. Yeah, we're gonna, definitely going to mess you up. Looks like this guy wants to get on it, too. Let's mess you up, since you're getting a lot of land down there. This guy wants to get in on that, too. Keep myself healthy enough to deal with Ace Nords. Keep bodying this guy. Not how I want this to go down, but it's how it's going down. Alright, um... Alright, we've got to save up here. Ace Nords is looking healthy enough. Got to keep ourselves nice and healthy compared to Nords. As long as I have like, the same amount of troops as him, it's fine. Right, this is good. We're doing well here. Got the crown. Just need to stay higher in health than Ace Nords here. And troops. We'll be good. Keep it about a million higher than his. We send again. There we go. Luckily that guy didn't full send on us. Hit him again here. Not bad. Now we attack Nords is next. You are actually... Eh, we're like almost like 20,000 pixels bigger than you. That's fine. Sorry about There shall be no truces. Hey, my boat's made it. Nice. We got to save up here. I'm oh, sorry, I gotta deal with you now. You're just gonna be a problem for me if I start fighting other people. We got a boat down there, because why not? A little boat strat, best strat, huh? Start clawing away at you. There's the attack. Here, have a boat. Have a boat strat, baby! We love the boat strat. We need to secure this faster than... It's looking pretty good, actually. I'd say our odds of win are decent at this point. Even if he full sends, I think we recover fine. And then we roll through him and... These guys are taking a while to secure it up there. So the fact that it's taking so long to secure it up there is actually pretty solid for us. There's the full scent of impatience. And that's going to make it real easy to uh, polish it off around here. We'll get a few of these while we wait for that to grab. Alright. And then we'll go ahead and... Uh, you know what? Ooh. We can't waste too much time. This guy's building up over there. As much, like, it's satisfying to get all these islands and push that guy out, but it's usually not a good idea, because sometimes, in the 30 seconds it takes me to do that, like, three people will leave up here, and one guy will gain control of all North America, and just, like, smash me from behind while I'm distracted, so it's not usually a, a great thing for us to do. A little bit of this, keep going. At this point, though, when I have all of South America, it's going to be very tough for them to beat me. They could theoretically team up on me and get something going here, but it won't be easy for them. Do a zero boat send to grab that island, because when you're this big, a zero send sends more than zero for some reason. Let's start smashing. This guy, see this guy's pretty, see how big this guy is? If I had been boating down there and this guy had left, this guy would have just taken all this and been a big old threat for us. See like that? See what just left? If that had happened when this guy was there. We're good, though, I think, right now. Yeah, see how he's almost caught up to us in size here? Look at this. He's actually... Oof, man. He's almost... Yeah. He almost surpassed us in uh, stuff there. In troop count and all that. Let's get a little zero-cost boat over here, shall we? Boat here. And have a nice little bit of this. If I had been busy boating and he had gotten all this secured, he would have wrecked us. He's trying to ignore us and carve through up there faster than we carve through them. It could theoretically work for that for him if all the people he's attacking just insta leave. The Brox Knight whores attacking, so that'd be this guy here. We have a have a nice little boat over here. Wish boats were better. Keep smashing through here. Here we go. See, look, he's actually he's actually catching up. He's actually catching up. It's a good thing we didn't waste time boating down there. He's actually carving through them faster than we can carve through him. It's a problem. It's a problem. Need to keep saving. All right, he's down on troops now. There we go. And keep saving. He's carving through him so fast. Oh, please stop. Full send. He's full sending. He's actually carving faster than I can carve through him. He's actually carving faster than I can carve through him. No. Get him. Oh, he's attacking back. The fact that he's starting to attack us now is actually good. If he ignored us, boated over here and started going through that, that'd be bad. 
He was literally carving their land away faster than I could carve land away from him. The fact that these guys left and gave him stuff for free like that was bad for us. Making it a lot closer than it needed to be. But I think at this point... We're lucky that he's not sending boats over there. He should send a boat... If he had sent a boat over to there, like, instantly, and got all that land really, really quick, it would be an, it would be an extremely close game. But the fact that he's not doing that and he's focusing on attacking us is actually going to cost him the win. Even if he has, like, oh, he is, he is, he did send a boat. Okay, so he did do that, actually. He's just also attacking us at the same time. But the mistake he's making is he's being impatient. He should have just waited for his boat to go over there and not attacked us back at all. He wasted a lot of troops attacking us back. He might have sent too many things on his boat there. I think we're, I think we're good at this point. Here, have a little boat strat, huh? Have a little boat strat, baby. Would you like a little more boat strat? I think you would. I think you would like a little more boat strat. That's the good stuff right there. I think we're good at this point. I don't think he has enough land to gain there to make it for the damage we're dealing to him. Boat strat? Yeah, we'll do a four million boat strat. That's the good stuff right there. Yeah, at this point, just almost. It's a good thing we didn't waste our time islanding down there because it would not have gone well for us. Boat strat is just satisfied. Somebody else is attacking as well. We don't care. Is this guy? Are you the one attacking us? That's the Brox Knight Horde. Help's up, buddy. How are you up here and down there? What the heck? You attacking over here. There we go. Yeah, he's done for at this point. You tried, man. You did your best. It was a worthy attempt. There's the full send of defeat because he knows it's over. He knows it is over. There we go. Well played, sir. You did very well. If I had wasted time getting those islands down there... The 30 seconds messing around with that could have easily cost me the match. Hard to say for sure. Let's go ahead and get all these uh, islands and whatnot. Got to have 99% of the land to win. Now, I know for this is my second free-for-all win in a row. The last free-for-all win, I was like, Wait, did I win two in a row? I looked it back. No, I'd lost one in between. But I definitely won my one before this. So there's actually two free-for-all wins in a row on the America's map, mind you. That's two wins in a row on the America's map. Who are you? Oh. Is it this guy? Get out of here. So I've, that's two wins in a row on the same map. Pretty good. Both from the same spawn point, actually, so... Pretty, pretty lucky right there. We we basically just got super lucky that, um... On this start. Well, we, we played well, but we also had a bit of luck. The game is 75% skill, 25% luck. Can I not send a boat from here to there? Are you joking? I swear the boats in this game are dumb. I swear the boats are dumb. The boats, they're dumb. Grab and get this land for me, huh? I don't mind a few stragglers. Chill. I will take out a few bots, though. Take out a few of these bots, right? But these guys that are, like, chilling on a thousand different islands, like, forget it. I'm not going to try and clear all those out. It's too much of a hassle. Just get my 99% call to dubs, you know? Get my 99% call to dub skis. All I need is 99% of the land to win. That's all I need. That's how, buddy. Guys really want to stay around as long as possible. Smash that like button if you like Territorial IO and you want to see more of it on this channel. Let's go.